So, EA just dropped the 87 plus base or FIFA World Cup hero, one of five player pick. Let's open these up and hopefully get some decent heroes. For cheap, fast and reliable foot coins, check out MMO EXP. There is a link down below and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. It is relatively expensive. It's like an 86 rated squad, an 85 rated squad, 84 rated squad with a couple of informs required as well. But it's one of five. So the chances of getting something good are high. We're looking for that World Cup Marquisio, that World Cup, yeah, yeah, Torre, that World Cup uh, Forlan. You know, that's what we're looking for. Come on, EA. Di Natale is not bad. World Cup Cap de Vier is also very good. Oh, we got a choice on our hands right now. We have got a choice on our hands. Cap de Vier is class. One of the better left backs in the game. Uh, Di Natale is also class, but I feel like Di Natale might be like lagging behind a little bit. 800k for Cap de Vier. Di Natale is currently going for about 250. I mean, yeah, I'm going to go Cap de Vier based on value, I think. That, to me, just seems like the right choice. To me, I think, like, one of the best left-backs in the game. There we go. We'll go ahead and grab him. Store him in the club. 800k card right there. We did well. I think one of five. One of five options is a solid, solid... Um, like, I feel like we're going to get some good stuff there. A premium pivot pack as well for 3,000 FIFA points. Contains 70 rare golds, 5 guaranteed to be walkouts. Can we get a foot fantasy, EA? Apparently not. We get ourselves a normal gold card on the front. De Kevin De Bruyne, 91. Not bad. We'll take Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, the United kit. That doesn't look good, does it? E. Lloris, Robertson, Rodri, Coman. I mean, quite a few walkouts. Hey, we do get ourselves a foot fantasy. We get Deli Ali chilling there at the back. Um, fair enough. And then a team of the year loan. Uh, you know what? We'll take Vidic. Very, very nice. Okay. That's not a terrible... That's not a terrible pack, to be honest. Not amazing. But it's not awful. I, I, I will take that. It's all right. All right. Next hero player pick. First one was good. First one is a solid W to start off with. Here we go. Come on. Yeah, yeah, Torre. Captain Vier again. Wow. All World Cup heroes in that one, actually. Uh, Captain Vier's solid. Q was all right. Dirt Cow is decent. We'll take Captain Vier. That's who he wants. I understand that. It is kind of annoying considering he's got a foot fantasy out at the moment, but it's still a really good card. It's an 800k left back, and he's got great links, so we'll take that. That's solid. All right. Next hero player pick. We're still looking for Marquisio or Yaya Torre. A Kocha World Cup would have been class. The normal card does not hit the same, sadly. That's our worst one so far. That is... Uh... That is not good. That is not good, sadly. Um, I think combined, I don't even know if you break even with all the players combined with that player pick. That's our first L. Modern Fury's base or World Cup hero player pick now. Come on. You know, we'll take Cap de Vier again. He seems to be giving out a lot of Cap de Viers. He's very happy. He wanted Cap de Vier. I should take Abdi Pele for him just to annoy him. Um... Don't get me wrong. I'm happy for people getting the uh, getting the captive ears and whatnot. However, I also would like to see some, you know, some World Cup hero volors and forelands and Yaya Torres and whatnot too. All right, next player pick. Can we get another captive ear? EA? Don't get me wrong. I am happy for getting captive ears because he's a 750k card, right? He's a he's a monstrous W. It's just like, you know, let's mix it up a little bit. EA, let's get a voler or you know, someone someone different for a change. Here we go. Smaller egg, it's not amazing, sadly. Um, Abadi Pele as well, meh. I wish they'd have mixed this in and put the other the, the new Foot Fantasy heroes in. I imagine what you're going to do is you're going to do a party bag at the end of the year, or maybe two different party bags or campaign bags now, where it's like one's going to be for all the different icons in the game and one's going to be for all the different heroes in the game. That would be really cool. Premium pivot pack now on the other account. Here we go. We need fodder. We need fodder for this um, hero player pick, realistically. That's what we need. Is an inform Cobell 88? 87. 87 inform Cobell. What else have we got? Come on, fodder, yeah. Just give me loads of fodder, please. Okay, we got a decent amount of fodder. Foot Fantasy? Yeah, Peter Crouch. Foot Fantasy hero, Peter Crouch. Shame I don't use his account at all. But we get ourselves five star skill, Peter Crouch, there. We take that. Not bad. Who's going to be our lone icon? Ronaldinho. That's actually a really, really good pack. Is Peter Crouch expensive? I doubt it, right? 300k! Oh, you take that. That's a big W. You take that. That is solid. 
Cheeky little Peter Crouch. All right, on to our second account now for the base or World Cup hero. Here we go. A huge Oakin. I don't use this account. No. No. I don't use this account, man. That is so annoying. No. Oh, we got ourselves David Ginola on this account that I literally don't use. I'll take it, though. 1.4 million coins. You'd love to see it. At the same time, that is painful, EA. All right. Next hero player pick. Come on, EA. Let's get another Ginola. Oh, why did I have to get the Ginola on, on my, my account? Why couldn't I get that for somebody else, even? Like, I'd have much preferred to get the Ginola for somebody else, because I don't play on that account. Voller's okay, Smaller X okay, Cole is okay. It's not a great player pick. All right, pivot pack right now. 55 rare gold players, two guaranteed 86 or higher, one prime icon loan player pick uh, between three players. Loan is for 20 matches. All right, let's run it. Pivot pack. Here we go. Go on, let's get a foot fantasy, yay. Yeah? Inform. German. Cam Muller. Okay. 88 rated. Not bad at all. We'll take that. That's solid. That is solid. Um, We'll take that. All right. All right. Thomas the Mule. Danglas. Ooh. Inform Romero as well. Not a bad pack. What we got for our prime loan icon or our loan prime icon? Probably should have said it the first way around. Uh, Rykard anyway. Yeah, I'm not that bothered. Um, I'll tell you what though. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, it's quite a lot of dupes. I'll take it. Two informed walkouts is not awful. All right, next pivot pack now on my other account. What are we saying? Come on, let's get a fantasy foot. Nice, a gold card. I don't know if they pop up behind gold cards. Young Minson, 89 rated. Like, maybe, maybe, like, a couple of them could pop up behind there. But I don't think all of them will. I'm not sure. What are we saying? It's all right for fodder, actually. It's a pretty good, pretty good pack for fodder. Uh, our loan prime icon is going to be a 20-game loan of... Rubbish. Terrible. Whenever it's a longer loan, I always feel like, like the odds are terrible. If it's like a five-game loan, you're getting R9s. But for 20 games, they're not giving you an R9. All right. 89 plus primer World Cup icon pack. He needs a midfielder. Hullet would go down a treat right now. Vieira, someone like that. <laughs> Prime Eric Cantona. Prime King Eric Cantona is a big W. What are we saying for value? Like a mil and a half at least? Maybe two, two and a half mil maybe? 2.2 .2 million. Solid. Solid. That is a class pull, man. Very good card indeed. 85 plus defender and an 85 plus midfielder pack. These must have been saved for a while, no? I imagine for a, quite a long time. It's a, it's a gold card. It's not a great start, is it? Rodri. Eesh. Not ideal. Maybe a dangler? Oh, what? Ben Rama dangler? Shame uh, West Ham are absolutely terrible at the moment. Just lost 5-0 to Brighton. But it's not a bad looking card. That's pretty decent. Could play Cam as well. Hey, take that. A solid. Okay, so these do pop up behind normal walkouts. All right. So, so bear that one in mind. Um, 85 plus defender three player pack now. Inform. What we got? Welsh right back Roberts. Not too shabby. 86 rated Roberts. What about a dangler for fantasy here as well? No, but we do get a Hubendush and a Laporte. That's solid, man. That is a solid couple of packs. We're going to end off this video with the three pivot packs on my Xbox account now. Uh, let's see if we can get something good. Realistically, fodder is appreciated, so we can do the hero player pick. Um, we get an Italian centre forward. It's in form Candreva. Fair enough. Uh, not ideal, but not terrible. Take mids easy. I've already got him untradeable, so I'm just going to discard that. Uh, we will have to come back and recover that Rodri as well, but he'll go into the hero player pick for sure. Then we have the uh, normal pivot and then premium pivot, Pat. Right? Yeah, normal pivot, premium pivot. This one's got 55 rare gold, two guaranteed to be 86 or higher. Can we get a um, foot fantasy? We know that they pop up behind gold cards. I don't, I don't want to look at Trent right now. I, do, I really do not want to look at Trent Alexander right now. We got ourselves Solomon from uh, Newcastle. No foot fantasy, sadly. But we do get ourselves uh, Man of the Match Solomon. 
Fekir and Martinez. Uh, we get ourselves... I'm going to take Primetto on a 20-game loan, because why not? Um, I, th I just don't want to look at Trent. I'm going to discard it. I don't want to look at Trent right now. It's too soon. And then the premium pivot pack now. Come on, EA. To end off the video, can we get a foot fantasy? Here we go. It is a man of the match, Brazil. Portugal, left wing. It is going to be Pedro Goncalves from Sporting Lisbon. What else have we got in there? Anything else? Oh, I guess that's one of the match, Hula, uh, Holohan as well. Uh, Jimenez, Morris, Mores, Pedri. Hey, Fernando as well. We'll take that. We get ourselves Foot Fantasy Fernando. Shame Sevilla just aren't amazing this season, are they? As far as I'm aware, anyway, I might be wrong, but I'm pretty sure they're not very good. Uh, I'm going to take a Duke Perlo. We'll just combine him and make 12. All right. No, it's not, not a terrible pack to end off on. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're not here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.